As the wise believe, the Big Bang explosion is said to have created our known and unknown universe of galaxies, stars, planets, moons, and so on. Eons passed while the universe kept on expanding, and at a certain point of time, Earth, our little blue planet, came on the scene. Life could be seen evolving not just in water, but also on land and air. Over time, millions of creatures, including all kinds of birds, animals, and yes, the human race evolved. As they say, a man is incomplete without the woman, and so is the woman without the man. However, although both complete each other, their coming together often looks forward to yet another spring of joy in their life. The joy of parenthood. No doubt, the arrival of a new life is no less than a miracle itself. Despite this, with rising infertility all over the world, parenthood is something not all couples can take for granted. But hold on, with increased tech advances in the world of Web3, artificial intelligence, or AI, has held out a fresh ray of hope. Today, infertility is growing insanely almost at the rate of an epidemic. Consider this, one in four couples in developing country is impacted by infertility. Worldwide, a whopping number of 48.5 million couples experience infertility. And the COVID pandemic seems to have made it even worse. So post-COVID, doctors are noticing a decrease in the egg quality in women as young as 27 years of age. In males too, the quality of the sperm has deteriorated. Yes, delayed marriages and lifestyle diseases like blood pressure, diabetes, thyroid have already led to high-risk pregnancies if not an outright case of infertility. Luckily though, scientific techniques like the in vitro fertilization or IVF have come to the aid of couples seeking babies. IVF is a process wherein an egg is removed from a woman's ovaries and fertilized with her man's sperm in a laboratory. The successfully fertilized egg and embryo is then implanted into her uterus to grow. Yes, today, 40 years after its heavily criticized clinical introduction, IVF is available as a successful treatment for infertility almost all over the world. Over 8 million IVF children have been born and over 2.5 million cycles are being performed every year, resulting in over 500,000 deliveries annually. Wow, well, the global IVF market is set to reach around $36 billion by 2026 as per an industry report. And in India, IVF is currently a $746 million industry and expected to double in the next five years. Yes, Vishaka, IVF is indeed a ray of hope, but not a foolproof solution to infertility. Exactly. So to make matters worse, access to fertility care is abysmal. Even in a developed market like the United States, just 2% of people suffering from infertility have tapped into IVF. Also, the success rate of IVF globally is nearly in the range of 35 to 45%, varying depending on women's age, BMI, quality of egg and sperm, to name a few. Well, this low success rate means that there is still a lot of opportunity to improve success rates, where a small advancement in technology can lead to a higher chance of starting a family. And that is where artificial intelligence steps in. Yes, the use of AI in IVF clinics holds great promise for addressing the challenges faced by couples struggling with infertility. Also, AI is being used to improve the accuracy of the selection of reproductive cells or gametes and the embryo, develop new drugs and treatments, and automate some of the tasks involved in IVF. AI could aid IVF specialists take a more objective decision based purely on the patient's clinical parameters to optimize for best outcomes. AI can also assist clinicians in tailoring personalized treatment plans for patients to boost success rates. AI can also improve accuracy, timeliness and monitor in IVF treatment thereby improving its success. Also, the use of AI in IVF is still in its early stages, but AI indeed has the potential to revolutionize IVF treatment. And let's hope the coming together of AI and IVF delivers desirous couples their prized bundle of joy. Sure. 
Well, that's all in our today's special segment. This is me, Ruchi Sharma, signing off. And this is me, Vishakha Thakur, signing off. We will meet again till then. Keep watching 3 Dotto TV. Please like, share and subscribe to our channel. And for more such interesting updates, please log on to our website www.3worstv.io or scan the QR code.